Okay, here's the uh, walkthrough video of the Broom Skipper Genesis. So, access to uh, the main cockpit area is just via two side doors. We hop into here. As you can see, there's a nice, spacious centre cockpit design. Uh, the Broom Skippers have uh, a soft canvas roof, like so, with supporting bars. Uh, these can then be folded backwards and just lay across the back of the uh, deck there. Uh, once that's uh, out of the way, uh, you can actually also fold back the side screens and also the forward screens, which give you a particularly low air draft. So these will cruise uh, most of the uh, Broadland bridges, um, sort of uh, uh, including uh, Potter uh, Higham if you're feeling brave. Steps down into the aft end of the boat. Gives us a lovely spacious saloon area. Uh, this pulls out into a double berth, as you can see here. You have the galley area with a full standing four burner hob, oven and grill. Sink unit there. And a uh, combination gas fridge. One of the original uh, Electrolux uh, types. Storage isn't in uh, short supply in the aft end of the boat. You've got a full size hanging locker plus plenty of storage cupboards uh, around on the port side there, including drawers. So looking forward, we've got two doors, uh, one to the left, uh, which takes us down to the toilet shower compartment. Uh, original finished design in here. Plenty of uh, space in this um, uh, toilet shower compartment. Uh, headroom's really good, uh, I've only got that much space. Um, above my head, I'm 5'8". Got toilet, uh, traveller toilet to holding tank. Usual uh, sink basin and uh, shower mixer just there. There's also some additional stowage. Um, we've got the uh, shower pump also in the um, cupboard under the sink. Door to the right takes us down to the forward cabin. So double offset berth, again with a dresser style unit here. Good storage, plus also additional hanging storage in the cupboard here. And the old style uh, catalytic heaters. And also a, a ventilation hatch above. Uh, whilst we're in the cockpit, we'll just have a look under the hood. Got a BMC 1.5 diesel. Again, flooring is a nice uh, teak and holly style wooden floor. Um, the boat itself has uh, been in uh, the current ownership since uh, 1992 and has a boat safety certificate until 2025. Uh, so uh, the, the current owners uh, have uh, extensively cruised the boat on the, the uh, Norfolk Broads and uh, nice to see an example like this. Um, very original um, in sort of the uh, finish and that and uh, as you can see the, uh, the the woodwork going around is all in pretty good shape for, for the age of the boat. Uh, other thing uh, worth noting she's also got is uh, Webasto uh, warm air heating. A quick walk around uh, the exterior. So, deck's all in very good shape. There we go. You can see the uh, 
canvas on the top there uh, is all very good. And then again, wandering around the back of the boat, sort of all original uh, sort of top surface, original gel here, all looks in uh, pretty good shape. Gas locker is just tucked in on the stern of the boat. Uh, boat's um, available and lying here at NYA Horning. Um, if you'd like to make an arrangement to view, uh, feel free to give us a call.